everyone and welcome it's day 19 of our daily advent cup of joe reflections and it's the 17th of december so we're getting down to the wire it's also week three week three is we remind ourselves god is with us and so we're going to focus on that a little bit today as we do our reading from the gospel in the name of the father the son the holy spirit amen today's reading is from the beginning of the gospel of matthew god help us to know you are with us as we read your word today Zadok became the father of Akim, Akim the father of Eliud, Eliud the father of Eleazar, Eleazar became the father of Mathan, Mathan the father of Jacob, Jacob the father of Joseph, the husband of Mary, of her was born Jesus, who is called the Christ. In the name of the Father, the Son, the Holy Spirit. Amen. Today's theme, genealogy. That is one of my very favorite readings in all of the scriptures. It is our family story. It's our genealogy. I know it can be boring, but I think it becomes less boring when we understand our family history and we get make it clear that we are all part of a family. And so today I have a picture of some, a picture of some of my own family. This is an older picture, but it's what I had available and big. Uh, myself, of course, in my ordination day. My dad Jim up here. Uh, my mom Sandy over there. Uh, my brother Dan over here and his wife Nikki and my nephew Noah uh, also now with us is Ella who I'll get to in a second and then also my sister Sarah who is now married and has Dylan with her and that's our family that's who we are and what a blessing it is to have that family I also want to point out uh, little Ella and Noah here uh, that's Ella and Noah my niece and nephew and the reason I want to do that is because they're kind of the tail end of our of a line right now i want to begin with that very thing because it would sound a lot like this there was a man and a woman named joseph and mary their last name happened to be Caesaric, and they had four kids they had joe marie bob and jim and of them of jim eventually he found a woman named sandy and the two of them had three children Dan, and Adam, and Sarah. And so far, Dan has been able to be blessed with two little kids, Noah and Ella. That's it. That's our genealogy. And that's what's happening right there. And this week, as we are reflecting on God is with us, I'd ask you to think about who in your family, or maybe it's beyond your family, are you estranged with right now? Because families are meant to be together. And trying to figure out who we need to be together with and allowing God to help us to see it's not us versus them or me versus you, it's, it's just us. And that's the beauty of this genealogy. Genealogy shows us that it is all about us. We are the family of God. Sometimes we might not get along perfectly, so be it, it happens in families. But today I'm going to ask you to pray about who is it that you're estranged with. Reach out to them. Give them a phone call. Write them a letter. Do something to reach out to them. Let them know that you care. And let them know you love them. And that might be what would be great for us as we remember God is with us. Not you or me. Us. All of us. Collectively as a family of God. Genealogy. Make today's cup of joy. Hope you find joy today. God bless you.